Hey YouTube, what's up? I'm Chris, and today is Monday, September 22nd, 2014, and this is Five Awesome Musicians. You are my champion, my friend, and I'll keep on singing to the end, cause you are my champion, my music. To my world. This weekend I had the honor of speaking at the Student Leadership Retreat for the Illinois American Choral Directors Association. A group of choral music education students from across the state of Illinois gathered together at Illinois State University. What I did is I talked to them about Rita Pearson's TED Talk about how every kid needs a champion. So I have a question for all of you out there and my four other awesome musicians. Who is your musical champion? And a champion is someone like a knight who would take up a shield and stand up for something that he finds is really important. And so a musical champion is someone who takes it upon themselves to champion music in your life. In my talk, I honored three people. My grandmother, my high school band director, and the band director at my first job. Right here, I'm gonna post a link to the entire video, but here's a clip. Too often young students are told that they can sing or shouldn't sing. And sometimes, it's because they sang too loud, they stick out like a sore thumb. Sometimes it's because their voices are too high or too low. And so maybe it's because they really are just tone deaf. It breaks my heart to see that and hear stories of so many students and adults that tell me that they can't sing. And when someone tells me that they don't sing, I usually ask them the follow-up question. Who did it to you? They gave me this funny look and I clarified. I say, who told you you can't sing? It's usually a teacher or a family member. I have a mantra in my classroom. It goes, I have a voice, it is a unique voice, and I will use it to make a joyful noise. I never mind having that tone deaf kid in my class. They never left the class quite as tone deaf as when they came in. I try to make it my goal uh, to become one of those students' musical champions. I can point out the champions in my life and how they helped me through my school years. So as you guys prepare to become music educators, I want to challenge you to think about your own musical champions. Who has touched you in your life and inspired, driven, or even pushed you into this profession? What makes you want to carry on the legacy of teaching students how to experience the joys of making music. How can you become a musical champion yourself? Think about how you can be one of those um, whose students look to for support, guidance, and motivation. Make music happen, no matter what the cost. Guide your students to pursue what they love and find your own inspiration so that you can inspire others. The biggest compliment I ever got as a teacher was when a young man came up to me after rehearsal, and he said, Mr. C, I love when you conduct. I can see how much you love music, and your passion makes me want to love music more. To me, being a music educator is not about selecting the best repertoire and being on a, uh, putting on a flawless performance. Being a music teacher is about being that champion that every kid needs. I hope you enjoyed that clip, and click right here if you'd like to see the whole thing. I hope you have a great week. We are five awesome musicians with an X that's just our way. And that's what makes us awesome. What else can I say?